In other news, Arirang TV, the station you're watching, has signed a memorandum of understanding with Dalian TV, a leading broadcaster in northeastern region of China. For more, we turn to our Wan Jihan. Korea's only public English channel, Arirang TV, has just established a cooperative relationship with Dalian TV, a leading broadcaster in the northeastern region of China. President and CEO of Arirang TV, Pang seok and Vice President of Dalian TV, Song chang Lee signed an MOU on Thursday afternoon at the headquarters of Dalian TV. The signing of the MOU between Dalian TV, the most important media outlet in China's three northeastern provinces, and Arirang TV, which reaches 130 million households worldwide, will effectively and swiftly deliver news from Northeast Asia to the entire world. Arirang TV, based in Seoul, was founded in 1996, and it is Korea's staple English broadcasting station, viewed in more than 100 countries, as well as at the United Nations, as it joined the UN in-house network in July. Dalian TV, on the other hand, was established in 1970, and it boasts an audience of over 10 million viewers in the northeastern region of China and nearby Russia. The channel is particularly known for its coverage on issues relating to the Korean Peninsula and Japan. With the agreement, both companies wish they can benefit from each other by active content and cultural exchanges. We can collaborate on more programs together and create more material that can show the good relationship between Korea and China. Through the MOU, the two broadcasters aim at building a strong foundation in the region by means of active exchange of mass media material. Wan Jihan, Arirang News.